All right, you too. I'm gonna do, I have a airflow box now. Now I'm not gonna be using this to measure CFM because I don't know how to do that. But what I can do is use it to like, see how well my vacuum cleaners can do on airflow wise and see which one can get the most. I'm, I have three of them on the um, shop block chart. Um, we're gonna, I'm gonna do three vacuums that I expect a difference in between. It's gonna be my G5, Avalier, and my Sanitary SE684. Um, I have the G5, I'm using this to plug them in, so bear with me. Just so you can see the vacuum and everything. My favorite part of anybody else. Um, okay. Um, allow me to plug it in for you all. And let's get it go. for fun it's not to act to get any true results yet and this is no all how much CFM they have and now we're gonna go for the test of the Avalier my favorite Avalier in. did score four something higher than the G5 did. And now for the Sanitaire, SC684. Technically, this would be what a seven amp unit would do. I got, I got now with the Sanitaire, I am mean, gonna have to tilt his handle back <laughs> because, um, because of the shakeout bag design, um, the more down the handle is, the more airflow you're gonna get. <laughs> and I'm just gonna do it in an average vacuum position. Okay, well.
Minnesota Sanitaire did score the highest. Um, like, comment, subscribe, stay tuned for more.